Yo, what is up guys, GD0 bringing you some Pokemon Ultra, no, I'm just joking. I'm bringing you some Pokemon Sun and Moon Wi-Fi battle. It's gonna be a double battle, guys. Uh, if my game works, there we go. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna give you a double battle. Uh, it's gonna be four, I'm gonna put it on flat rules, it's gonna be four. Hormones that we're gonna be picking to choose in this double battle. Um, let's see. Hold up. Let me check here, my dude. You know what? Actually, I don't need to do that right now because I mess with around with a lot of editing stuff, so I could do whatever it is I'm just gonna try to do. But yeah, we're gonna go with the flat roll battle, so it's gonna be able to let us choose Hormones in this battle. Do, 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 do. And since I'm actually using my moon version, I get to use the team that I wanted to do for the longest. A little bit change up there and there. It's kind of homage to the Gen 1 team. Well, not the Gen 1. It's more like the Gen 1, Gen 2 that I usually used in previous battles before when it was like one of my OP teams. I call it my OP team, but you know, it's been like some, you know, back and forth, back and forth with it. Uh, one, I also told uh, Blue Axe that we weren't going to do any Ultra Beasts. And he, had, he brought up Balls, Bells, Balls, blah, 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 blah. Bells, Boswell, or whatever you call this. This Ultra Beast Pokemon that looks like a bug that's lifting way too much. Um, I honestly don't know what to do with that. I mean, I could send in, I could send in my Tritanitar, uh, hoping to probably flinch whatever Pokemon he has into there because I'm Choice Scarf. And probably lead off with uh, my uh, my technician. Uh, let's see, yeah, with my technician uh, mega evolved Caesar, where I could just source dance and get the boost, and also Iron Head just in case. But I don't know what else I could do. Furthermore, again, he still choose Boswell. I hope he doesn't choose choose it in battle though. That's another major thing that I hope he doesn't do is generally choose it in battle. If he chooses in battle, I'm just gonna like. Regardless if he wins the battle or not, it still kind of like irks me. In a situation where I tell them no Ultra Beast in the first place, but again, it just irks me. Um, even though it was a double battle rule, I tell him no legendaries and Ultra Beast, and yet he still has his Ultra Beast here. I'm kind of upset, and. Let's see, what is it? The bug fighting type? And then I have Primarina that's also like Water Fairy. Again, I am Choice Scarf, so I am gonna go for the Iron Head. I am gonna go for the Source Dance to getting the plus two, and then I could just Iron Head on top of that. I'm not gonna go for the Mega Evolution. Because I don't think I could go for the Mega Evolution. I don't even think I have the Mega Potential anyway to go Mega Evolution as yet. Because I just barely started my Moon version. I only got like to like the finish the uh, second trial island anyway. So I won't be able to Mega Evolution just yet. But overall, 
still kind of a little bit mad. You know why? I'm kind of still a little bit mad. The fact that it happened like that. <clears throat> it goes for the energy ball. Not bad. Not bad. Energy ball is not bad. Not bad. I'm not really fearing the energy ball. Not really. Not not too much. Uh. Oh, this would have been perfect if I was choice scarf into bite now. Uh, I'm gonna still have. I'm still gonna go for the iron head. I'm not gonna switch out. I'm still gonna go for the iron head. Um. I'm at plus two. I want to go greedy and go for a plus four on the storage dents. Yeah, I'm gonna go first. I'm gonna go for plus four. So I'm gonna let my uh, cipher gain get a plus four, hoping to get a flinch off his. Uh, what is what is this? Yeah, I got a flinch off his shadow. He's gonna go for the shadow ball, trying to. What is that? No, Moon. He goes for Moon Blast to try to drop my special attack, but it still wasn't able to take out the um, Tritonitar. So, again, he can't do anything. I'm I plus four, and I was hoping that he would just go generally take out the uh, Caesar because Caesar is more directly the threat. But, again, if he does win. He does get the opportunity to get in one of the Marshadow giveaway cards. But again, it's one of those things where I don't know. Because he. It's just. He's going to realize that I'm kind of a little bit upset. But I'm not going to call him on it. Because. Is either if I win, I win. Regardless, I probably win by default. I might win by default. If I win by default, I win by default. Because if if I win regardless, I win. But since he choose a ball bell or whatever you call this dang Ultra Beast Pokemon, since he choose this Pokemon. Again, I'm generally upset. I'm generally upset because he chose this mod. Now, again, I'm not really too concerned. I'm not. I'm not too concerned. I'm just hugely mad that he chose it. I'm just hugely mad because, regardless of him choosing the mod that he chose, I'm just mad completely mad but if I win then you know good to me kudos to me because I won but either way it was gonna be a win by default anyway because it was just one of those things where regardless I was gonna win just hypothetically I was gonna win Regardless of the situation, I probably was going to win anyway. But I wish he would have just listened to the rules. Because the reason why I said I was going to win regardless is because he chose the Pokemon. Anyway. So that just pits me at an automatic will win. But I'm not going to message him about the situation. Let me see right here. Because I think he sent me a message to... Forgot about the Ultra Beast. Well, okay. Well, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna let it slide. If he forgot about the Ultra Beast, I'm just gonna let it slide. I'm not gonna be too upset. He forgot about the Ultra Beast. I'm gonna allow him to keep the Ultra Beast. But like again, like when battles like that happens, where I'm like, okay, why is that there? When I you know specifically say something about it, and you still have it there. So, it again, it's all right. I'm not gonna complain about it. It just again, I'm not gonna complain about it. I still kind of won, so 
regardless of what happens now, I'm pretty much in that victory win. Oh my. That did a lot of damage for a fighting type move that, that you're supposed to be resisted, Professor. You're supposed to be resisted to that move. I don't know how did you not get, you know, more of a effective move. I wish Roost could work in a way where it could help heal your other Pokemon too. It's like, I don't want to use rest, you know, Roost on me. I'd rather use Roost on the other opponent, my, or, you know, not use it on my opponent, but use it on my Pokemon, my other Pokemon. To get back to full health because at least he needs the help. I'm just gonna say it's okay. For now, it's okay. So, again, at first I was kind of mad that he had it. But again, it was just one of those things where I was like, oh, yeah, I forgot I had the Ultra Beast. Okay, well, at least you told me you forgot that you had the Ultra Beast. Fine, it's fine, whatever. Uh, and GG. Uh, gonna go ahead and reply to him. Also, GG. Um, yeah, if you guys enjoyed this uh, match, you know, I, I don't even know what to say anymore. But if you guys want to participate in matches like this, um, definitely come meet me on them, you know, and I'll start sending out requests for matches like this when I do get stuff that a potential giveaway and whatever. I'll basically, you know, send something out. That was fun. It was fun. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next um, match if I ever get another match. I'm pretty sure I am because I know a lot of people might want a Marshadow gift card or, you know, the mythical uh, giveaway card. So definitely, definitely make sure you're following me on Amino so when I start requesting battles, you guys could just, oh, battle! Bye, guys.